Malta is really my everything. I think that um, you can't possibly be interested in the history of human civilization and not come to Malta. It still remains one of the most interesting, beautiful, warm, um, spiritual, historic places I've ever been to. I remember the bells in Ashar, the bells, beautiful, the, the, the chiming of them, in, especially Sunday morning. I remember the scent of the festas. I remember the scent of the incense in, in the processions. I remember the smell in Hal Ormi um, emanating from the bakeries. The best bread in the world is baked in Malta. It's only good for three hours after you buy it, but it's really the best bread you can find. Our story, you really cannot find it. You will not find an island of our proportions, of our size, with our history, with, with, with our own language. There's, there's no other island like us. Eight, nine weeks in a row in a country, and I'm walking in the terminal, and through the window, I see our plane with the Maltese cross. I'm like, oh God, I'm home. And then when I step on it, I ask for a kidney with ice, and then I am home. <laughs>